Let's do this. How's it going? Hey, Arthur. Can, can I have a quick word? Yes, Miss O'Shea. Ah, call me Molly, would you? Oh. Arthur, how is Dutch? I mean, how does he seem to you? I'm about the same as usual, I guess. I... I really love him, you know. But if he... Like he always says, loyalty is everything, so... Arthur! Excuse me, Miss O'Shea. What you want? I bring a gift. The great gift of information. So you got some tip-off, so now I can yeah. risk my neck and make you some money while you lounge around. You know, Arthur, bitterness, it, it works on the inside as well as on your sour face. If you say so, but you could go find some other fool to run your errands. Bill, come on over here. Will you be my other fool? You too, Charles. What are you? Talking about. Arthur's above a little stick up I heard about. No, I'm not. You just said. Hey, I'll do it. As long as you ride with us. <laughs> well, I got a serious medical condition. <laughs> yes, you are a compulsive liar. No need to be like that. Charles, have I ever lied to you? I hardly know you. Exactly. Now, you boys should do this. It, it's easy, and I'll only take a small commission for my information. But it's now or never. Then it's never. Oh, God help me. Fine, I'll do it. <laughs> well, what is it? It's a supply wagon carrying payroll, but very briefly unguarded, apparently. As it passes through a crossroads near here where there's an old ruined church before it connects with the rest of the wagon train. Very easy picking. As long as we get paid or you get shot, I'm happy. You are a sick man, Arthur Morgan. A very sick man indeed. <sighs> Come on, then, you miserable bat. How do you get wind of this old one? Him? We only been down here all of five minutes. Well. Wow, you boys went off fishing. Good Playing lawman or whatever the hell you've been doing. I've been getting down to business. <laughs> Finding the nick. Chris Grog House. Hey, you don't want in on this, Williamson. That's fine by me. Do us all a favor. Head home. Just give it a rest, you two. Just have a little faith for once, will you? I've been scoping jobs like this since you fellers were knee-high to a grasshopper. Once a decade, maybe. So what is it you've scoped here exactly? Well, I told you. There's a wagon with a lockbox passes through every week. They switch outriders just north of here, but the front wagon's by itself for a stretch before the last run down into roads. <laughs> Okay, hold up here. We should cover our faces. Oh, they'll be passing through... Crossroads up ahead. When? Soon, Williamson. Christ's sakes. I should be due any time now. Let's keep this quiet and clean. Nobody needs to die here. There! You see, gentlemen? <laughs> Just like clockwork. <laughs> I said, stop the damn wagon! Whoa! Now, don't try anything stupid! 
and we won't do anything unkind. You know, boys, I, I don't, I don't want to get shot, but this is a mistake. I work for Cornwall Kerosene and Tar, Mr. Leviticus Cornwall. Oh, great. So you know him? <laughs> Who doesn't? I hear he's rich enough to share the wealth around and not miss it too much. Oh, he'll miss it. OK, why don't you check out around the back? Arthur, help me out here. Now, let's see what's inside. Okay, we're looking good. Must be nearly a thousand here. Shit! Hey! Think I see something! Oh, great. Let's go! Arthur, let's go! Yeah! Yeah, dude! Stop! Get back here! Hold it right there! Drop your goddamn weapon! Right now! Oh, now, now. There's a gun. Come on! Light a shot, boys! Get rid of these sons of bitches! Blow down, sons of bitches! Yeah. Well, nice going, Uncle! Most guarded wagon in goddamn history! How loud I know! You wait, you sons of bitches! Come on! We need to lose them! Yeah! Hey, go! Hey, with <laughs> Stay until dark, and then we'll sneak out of here. Charles, you keep watch for now. Sure. Well, we, uh, get some rest. Ugh. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> Let's try and get out of here. Hey, shit! Absolutely. Well, shut up, old man. Well, look, I was just trying to... Shut up. There's a light over by the house. Damn. Hey, now let's just keep this calm. See what happens. Is this your place? Kinda. Uh, and you didn't hear nothing? I... I... I why don't you just tell me, partner, what you heard? I, I, tell me what you heard. I don't... Maybe I, I heard some noises out by the barn a while ago. Ain't me. Better not be. All right. Coop forth. Lo, go check out the, the barn. Uh, sir. <clears throat> Place looks deserted enough. Sure. You head inside, I'll go round the back.
place looks empty to me. And the old guy up there is full of crap. Yeah, I don't think they're here. Don't see any horses. Come on, let's head back. Boss! God damn it, Arthur! What was that? Let's fly at them, boys! Watch it, Chuck. We got more of the bastards on this side. You'll be sorry. Watch out. More on the roof. from finding us any... Try to confuse him. Arthur, with me. Anything dumb, Williamson, you're on your own. Oh, shut the hell up. Quick, behind these rocks. They're coming. They're... Perfect. Yeah. Need to do this quiet. You take the left, and I'll take the right, okay? You're right on my right. You see anything? Not yet. Young man's game. Uh oh, really? Those boys ain't as quiet as us. Guess we should go give them a hand. You're dead.
We all still alive? Yeah, just about. Yeah, I'll deal with you later. We got some money, didn't we? Sure, but now we got corn on our backs. It was an yeah. honest mistake. I'll leave it. Go on, get out of here. Every man split up. Go on, run quick. Good luck, Jens. Stay quiet and move. there. Arthur. Wondered when you'd roll back in. Some stroke of fortune, the room was next to mine. I like the bold lovers, new regions to explore. Todo lo causa la pasión de una mujer. Amigo vino. All right there, Morgan. Tú me tumbas yep. con tu aliento. You must be nervous being this close to the water. Las copas oh, llenas. Oh, don't you start. ¿Dónde están? I'm <laughs> just looking out for you. No las tengo. Si me emborracho es de puro sentimiento. Todo lo causa esa ingrata mujer. El whisky tomo, tomo yo por apetito. Compro mi trago 
Si me hace muy poquito Como una taza de tequila de mi abuelito Todo lo causa la pasión de una From me. To be treated with some respect and affection. All them out there, they're laughing at me. You think this is the way to a man's affection? Moping and pestering all the damn day? Good morning, Arthur. Oh, I can do a lot worse than that. Is that a threat? Another great way to a man's affection. Oh, shut up. Gladly. You heard about the coach job? Yeah. Another run-in with the Cornwall army. Yeah, it got heavy, but well, we came out of it with some money. Ladies? Morning, Arthur. Everything okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Fine. Good morning, Arthur. You going to get up? What's wrong, Arthur? No reason. Just making sure. All right, Arthur. I need to sleep. Hey. Are you hey. well? Oh, what do you want? 
Ah, I've forgotten what it was now. I gotta sleep, Arthur. Arthur! Yes, kid. You got a lot on? Ah, uh, just hunting for all this hillbilly gold that Dutch and Hosea seem to think is out there just waiting to be stolen. <laughs> Why? I got something. Could be good. Yeah? Yeah, I was in Rhodes talking to some of the colored folk. They said there's a gang of fools holed up in the swamps east of here who think their war ain't never ended. The Civil War? Yeah, apparently it's still raging in these fools' minds 30 years later. Okay. That ain't my point. These ignorant fools are weapon dealers. And in their dealings, sometimes sit on a decent pile of cash. Yeah, been selling weapons to Cuba and South America for years. Anyway, the old boy I was talking to reckoned there might be a bunch of cash just sitting around. And failing that, maybe a nice stash of weapons. With just a bunch of crazies, Gardner? Exactly. Well, worth taking a look at least, isn't it? That was my thinking. Said it was at some place called Shady Bear, deep in the woods. Okay. <laughs> I was hoping you'd be in. If it's how they told it, it's gonna be something all right. We'll see. Ladies. Hey. Hi there. Hey, get up. I'm sleeping, Arthur. I know the feeling. Girl. You're interrupting my beauty, Red. Come on. It's this way. On me. Cha. There, girl. Whoa! You all right, girl? You know, I might have met these crazies before. You've been drinking again? No. Well, yes, but no, that's not how I might have met them. I think some of them harangued me and Sadie when we were coming back with supplies. Mrs. Adler? Yeah. And Mrs. Adler did just fine. More than fine, actually. She's terrified. But I got a notion these fellers is one and the same. Yeah, we won't find no shortage of angry Peckerwood idiots in the state of Lemoyne. That's for sure. Is it really that different in this state? We haven't come far. It seems like it is. These boys got a manner about them, but I haven't necessarily noticed. All respect, Mr. Morgan. You wouldn't notice. Might call you a nigger lover. They see us riding like this. But most of it is a, a glance or a word. And after that, a visit in the night. Well, out west is... Out west is out west. And you're all who you are, right? Decent folks. But some places down here, they judge differently. Well, Anna, I guess it can't be so easy for you, Lenny. Sorry you're caught up in this. Well, I guess their gold's still shiny and their guns still shoot. <laughs> so I'm game for robbing any and every one of these bastards for all they got. <laughs> okay, then. Plus, it beats being lynched back in Blackwater with all of you by my side. I guess it does. Feels like we're close. It's a rundown old plantation house down in the bayou somewhere. Let's take it slow. Be cautious. 
If, like you say, these crazies are sitting on weapons, we're gonna want to strategize a little before getting shot at. <laughs> of course. They said find the old battlefield and keep on going. Well, we got some wrecked old Civil War weaponry. Now where are the wrecked old Civil War holdouts? You see that church up ahead? They're supposed to use it as an outpost. Heard they got men going between here and the big house all day. Okay. Look at this field. <laughs> Imagine getting caught up in a fight like this. Yeah, I don't care to. Hold those reins in. Let's just take a look around the place. I hear you. Uh, it doesn't look like anyone's here. We don't know that for sure. Let's have us a nosy. Hey, you see something? Why are you stopping? Hear that? Someone's on the track. Look there, a wagon. Let's see where he's going. You're on me now. Right behind you. Let's keep our distance. Just two fellers out on the road. Hey. That looked like dynamite in the back there? It looks like we're on to something. I think I see something. End of the avenue, between the trees. Might be it. Might be. Keep it steady. Hey, big plantation house. <laughs> Must be Shady Bear. I reckon we can leave our mounts up there, off the trail. Good enough to me. Come on. We can get a view on them from that wall up there. Make sure you bring your sharpshooter. I'll take the other side. You get in cover there. What you see through your scope? Just a moment. I'll wait on your say. I know dynamite crates when I see them. We got something, right? Oh, we got something. We can hit them head on, fight them honest. Or you could go down there acting friendly. Friendly? With these folks? Just draw them into one spot. Then I'll start shooting. Well, that might be the dumbest idea I've ever heard. But hey, I'm always up for a performance. You gonna make a call? You're going in, kid. Give them both barrels of charm. Wouldn't try anything less. Uh, today is a fine and fabulous day, as all days, and so may it be. <laughs> Praise be, my people. What do you want? Praise be, my people. Praise be. 
checked out. I come in peace to discuss the merit of glory and interest you in eternity. <laughs> Praise be my Just Praise a moment be. longer. Uh, are you? Have you? Will you be saved, my brother? Praise be. Huh? <laughs> praise be! I want you out of here now, boy. Hey, praise be, my people. Praise be. I said, get out of here. Uh, praise be, or a, a, a great miracle shall strike you down, my family. Get out of here, you darky! I said, a miracle shall strike you down. Get out of here, you nigger piece of shit! They might be on the way. Now let's grab something and get out. Sounds like a plan. Let's search these wagons, okay? You got anything? Not yet. Just body so far. I'll tell you when that changes. This one looks good. Search it. Search him. Here. Come on. This is full of new rifles. We can sell those, right? We sure can. We'll check the rest later. Now, come on. Let's go. Let's go, let's go. Get this back to camp. Yep. Yeah. Go, go! Let's haul! Come on. G up. 
Call in. Well, you ain't shot with the wind. Hey, riders, coming our way. Okay, keep a cool head. What's a black feller doing coming out of Shady Bell? In one of our wagons. Awesome, let's go! I'm looking, all right? I can't see anyone chasing us. I should think we're out of the woods then, so to speak. <laughs> boy, oh boy. <laughs> you did good. <laughs> we did it. Well, let's get to camp before saying anything like that. I know Sean's been bringing in quite a lot lately, and I wanted to... <sighs> it's good to have something to show like this. Sean's a loudmouth bragging. Don't worry about what Sean does. Hey, I like them, you know? Well, so do I. Guess my better judgment. Just, you worry about you. He wasn't on Leviticus Cornwall's train with me. We had to dig him out of Blackwater. But... No, no, but enough. Me and Dutch, and everyone who counts, we know what you do for this gang. We notice. Keep it up. You're gonna start seeing things change for you. Okay, then. Okay. Thank you, Arthur. Yeah. camps in these trees up here. Let's get there. Arthur, Lenny, coming back. These are fine rifles. Right? I'm gonna keep one, just for me. Hey, I always enjoy riding with you, kid. <laughs> you know how to fight. Hey, you too. Anytime, Arthur. Done good, girl. What are you wearing? Thinking of switching to the other side? <laughs> How are you doing, Molly? Fine. Fed up of moving all the time. Yep. Just the way it is. Okay, I'll catch you later then. Can't do much work. Sorry, That's ain't much company right now. Me and Lenny You're brought back. some guns in. Yes, I'm Robbed back. them off that gang that I runs heard around they here. They wanted to hang you. <laughs> they wanted to, but Arthur did me right. Of course. Did they ask uh, anything about us? No, it was just a uh, locals, a local problem. A fella I Mr. used to Morgan. know. Mr. Morgan, all right. okay. I've Thanks noticed so you've stopped paying into the box. I've been sort of attention. busy, Miss Grimshaw. Mm. Well, we all and need to eat, Mr. Foolish. Morgan. It was thing, I'll see what I can do. Got the better of me. Thank you. Thank you. Dutch? Mrs. Ed, hi. Hello. You boys are my family now. You 
You're welcome. How much thanking does one man need? You owe me. You managing not to kill Pearson? Only just. Ah, oh, he ain't that bad. Okay, then. All right, well, I should be getting on. Sure. Arthur, 